Hello guys and welcome back. This is The Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 4, Part 3. Uh, hope you enjoy. Uh, please subscribe and like and I'll try and get these uh, this uh, season done and then I'll get uh, Season 3 when it comes out uh, done and yeah. I guess that's the place there. Huh. It's a wreck. You ain't even been inside yet. Just look at it. Glass all blown out, walkers hanging around. Well, no way to find out until we go and check it out for ourselves. Maybe we can still find something. Yeah, maybe. Sorry, I just really want to stick with y'all to work out. It's been hard so far. How about you make it up to us by helping out with those walkers up there? Yeah, all right. James showed me a good way to attack them. If you take out a knee, they always fall. And then you can stab them in the back of the neck. Hmm. A good smack to the head's always been fine for me. Watch out for the broken glass. It's all over. Okay. Somebody's already been through here. Guess that's not a surprise. Still, might be something worthwhile left. Let's check it out. Not in a while, though. Let's just take a sweep. I really don't want to go back empty handed. Keep one eye on the woods while we're in here. I don't want nothing sneaking up on us. I'll watch this side, you watch the other. Deal. Where the hell's Bonnie? Do you think maybe they say that stuff about water and blankets just to get people out of the way? Oh, you don't know what the hell you're talking about. And you didn't have to come with me. No, I wanted to. Never mind. Lee would have loved this place. Do you see anything good? Not so far, but let's give the place a good going over. Oh, okay, don't speak to me. What a bitch. <laughs> there have sure been some animals through here. Watch where you sit. I sure hope we can find something to take back. Me too. I'm guessing you have to, uh... Oh, look at a few stuff. Any luck? No, not so much. Unless you want some broken glass. Empty. I tell you, I sure don't like being near a graveyard with the world the way it is now. The way things are now, you're in a graveyard all the time. Yeah, true enough. Do you think these work? Nah, they're just for show. Be handy, though. Also really loud. Good point. Souvenirs, huh? Looking for a keychain with your name on it? No. Why would I want a keychain? I don't even have any keys. Ah, <sighs> good point. Ha! <laughs> good, I keep going in them. Oh, where do we go now then? Let's go this way. I'm gonna be attacked in a minute. There's nothing even this way, what the hell? Is that it? Are you being serious? Wow, this is silly. 
found something. Hey, look at this. An old coat. Nice. Good find, Clem. You should hang on to that. It's gonna get a lot colder before it starts getting warmer. Kenny said we need blankets. It's not really a blanket, but... But it should do the trick. Good call. I guess you've already got that old coat I gave you. I feel so bad about everything that happened. Hopefully you won't always think of me like that. Not that I'd blame you if you did. I haven't always used the best judgment. You finally opened your eyes about Carver and what a bad person he was. That's something. Yeah. Clem found a jacket. That's great, but uh, isn't Gray the, you know, uh, we can't put Rebecca in a confederate coat. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Guess it's better than nothing, though. Oh, uh, look at that. <laughs> it looks like I was farting. That's just what we need. It's locked. You want to kick it down? That'd make an awful lot of noise. Yeah, maybe. You know, if somebody was small enough, they could maybe squeeze through that gap there. I could try to pry it open some more, but I don't know if that'll help much. All right, all right. I'll go. Thanks, Clem. Just open the door from the other side. Mike will carry those things out. Might be a bit heavy for you. Okay, maybe I push from... Mary and Joseph. Guess I'm not quite as small as I used to be. But you're tough for your size. Shit. You're tough for my size. I'm sorry I asked you. I won't do it again. At least now we got something to bring back. I'll keep checking the other room. Let's get this water. Not strong yet, Clem. That looks pretty heavy. Uh, that's all right. I know it looks like a lot, but we could all go through this pretty quick. Carl was crazy, but at least his shells were always full. You're right. I thought it looked like so much. That baby's gonna be hard on everyone, especially Rebecca. And between you and me, she's not looking too good. Hey, guys. Come on, stay close. I just walked on in like it owned the place. Figure it'd make a nice meal. We can eat raccoon? I'd eat the shit out of that raccoon. Not like, I mean, just, just that I'd be really happy to eat that raccoon. I'm starving. Fresh meat would go a long way with Rebecca. Yeah. Shoot! Don't let it get away! Where is it? I think it went over there. Oh, fudge. There he is! He's coming your way! Walk him! Oh, oh, shit! Grab it! Oh! Shoot. Oh, dang it. Dang it. <laughs> Not with the walk. 
lockers out there. get to a place where I'm sad I'm not eating raccoon. Well, at least it was kind of fun. Yeah. Huh. I guess it was. Come on. Let's just get this back to Rebecca and the others. We don't have much time to waste. I wonder what's James doing then? <laughs> Nothing's wrong. Babies know how to be born. How long did your son take? How you doing, Rick? Okay. I'm okay. How did you guys make Museums out? Museums are bust. All glass walls shattered. It'd be impossible. And it was picked over pretty good. Lots of folks probably been there before us. We almost caught a raccoon. What? Yeah. We thought it'd make a good meal, but it got away. Damn. Fresh meat would have been nice. Looks like you got some water, though. We sure did. Good. Good. We saved all of that for Rebecca. Anybody else gets a thirst, you can go to the river. you made it back safe. How are you feeling? Scared and it hurts. <sighs> I wish Alvin was here. Everything Alvin did was for you and the baby. Giving himself up to Carver like that. It was to try to keep you and the baby safe. Yeah. I know it's a waste of time. But I can't stop thinking about things I should have said to him. Things I should have talked to him about. How am I ever going to do this without him? Alvin was never scared. He would have done anything to save you and the baby. You're a good kid, Clementine. I'm glad you'll be there to watch out for this baby. Ugh. Oh, shit. I got this. I'm worried that we ain't seen Jane in a while. Go check on her, would you? Yeah, go on ahead. I'll be fine. Are you okay, Kenny? Sure. Why wouldn't that be? See if anyone wants a conversation. Ah, <laughs> oh, no, I want to speak to Luke first. Nice job finding those bottles of water. That's a good score. We couldn't have brought them back without Mike. Yeah, he's, uh, he's pretty strong, that's for sure. He thinks we don't like him. No, it's not that. I just think he's more eager than he has a right to be. Okay, he wants acceptance before he's earned it. Does that make sense to you? I guess so. have a shot out here? Ah, oh, so I don't have to say anything to them. That's rubbish. That walk seemed longer to you on the way back. No, but thanks for carrying the water. I didn't realize how tired I was until I put it down. I need to rest up a bit. Seems like folks appreciate it, though. That's good. Maybe they'll come around after all.
Sarah would say nothing. Hey, Clementine, up here. Oh, hey, museum was a bust, huh? We found water. A lot of it. Well, that's something, at least. Check this out. This gate's still locked, which means that hopefully no one's gotten to whatever was locked in there in the first place. And I've been trying to get it open, but it's locked pretty tight. Can't see what's inside. That could be a place for Rebecca to have the baby. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Hmm, maybe I can pick the lock. A nail file? Versatility is not overrated. You know, uh, it wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand at this thing. See if you can find something bigger. We might need to bust the mechanism. Uh, let well. Find anything? No, not even trash. Guess it's broken. Ow! Shit! You okay? Yeah. I think I almost had it. Keep looking. There's some buildings across the river. I think I can see a church. The nearest river crossing is miles up. Rebecca wouldn't make it in her condition. Keep it in mind. Though. Jane, there's someone coming toward us. <clears throat> shit, shit, shit. He's coming this way. And who knows if he has...